Want to recover the base metals from your spent aqua regia solutions? This video details an easy and environmentally friendly method of recovery. And, if you've massively screwed up your refining and just want to start over again, this is a great way to do that. When refining precious metals with aqua regia, chemical precipitants are used. These agents are highly selective, resulting in very pure metal in the form of mud or flakes. The non-precious metals, copper, iron, etc., remain dissolved in the solution. Commonly, these heavy metals are removed from the waste solution by the addition of a non-selective precipitant, such as zinc powder or aluminium foil. The zinc or aluminium dissolves, precipitating the heavier metals. A different technique, electrolytic recovery, removes all metals from solution without replacing them with zinc or aluminum. It sounds complicated and expensive, but actually, it's easy and cheap. This is what you will need. A bucket, or other plastic or glass container. Two plates or rods. These can be composed of graphite silver or titanium. They will be used as your cathode and anode. A rectifier, or a car battery charger, to supply DC current. And either a dish, or a shallow bowl. This will catch any metal that falls off your cathode. If you are going to use this process on a regular basis, you might want to purchase an anode bag, using it instead of the bowl. The process is very simple. Turn both your volts and amps all the way up. Then switch on your rectifier. The metal will plate out of solution and adhere to the cathode. This may take some time to complete. The higher the amps, the faster it will work. A larger anode and cathode will significantly increase the amps. You can also increase the amps by increasing the conductivity of the solution. This may be accomplished by adding TSP, trisodium phosphate, a powder generally sold in the laundry detergent section of supermarkets. When the amp gauge reads zero, the solution should become colorless. All the metal has plated out of solution. You can then recover the metal and discard the solution. If you have any questions regarding the recovery process, or any other process or procedure, please feel free to contact us. And, unlike me, you'll reach real people.